actually, time travel already exists and always has. <laughs> time travelers uh, invented time travel from the future, and uh, they're most likely amongst us now, and we would never know it. It's kind of like looking at a, a photograph of someone young, and then you, you, you look at them and you say, oh my god, they're like my age. And then when you see them, you know, in the current time, they're actually a lot older. So the photograph is sort of what time travel is to time travelers from our point of view. So while it's possible for time travelers to be amongst us, the chance of that is actually very unlikely. Because, you know, why go to this planet when you could travel to, to distant planets, you know, that you see in sci-fi movies that have uh, ominous volcanoes and... and uh, weird sea creature type things. No one wants to stay on this planet. A time machine. A chrome pod that the time traveler goes inside. Um, they close the door and they, could, they, they bring snacks with them even though he never eats the snacks because time travel goes really quickly. So he, do, he just eats the snacks later, uh, he or she, I, sh I should point out. And then they type in the date and the time of uh, where they want to go. And they type it on this, uh, it's like a, a keypad uh, calculator uh, type, th something that you type in the buttons, and then you pull the knob, and you just kind of yank it. And that's what puts it in motion, like yank it like that. Put the door open and then he or she is uh, in uh, his or her destination that he or she typed in. So, uh, so scientists have proven that we can only travel up and down uh, through time, not side by side. So it's our hope that in the future someone will invent a way to travel side to side and po separate from that possibly even uh, travel through parallel dimensions, you know, parallel, you kind of jump over. So try to imagine two universes side by side two Dr. Chris's, one in each universe. The, the things that we could, that we could accomplish are, are endless. I mean, I, c I could call him up one day and say, hey, do you want to go to the movies? And he, would, he wouldn't respond by saying, oh, no, I've seen that movie, you know, some other time. But hey, it's fine, you know, I'll pay for your ticket, you know, you just come along. Oh, I just don't feel like going out. That's, I, that's the reason I said no in the first place. Well, why didn't you just say that to begin with? You know, I wouldn't get any of that. I, I could give him a call and say, let's go to the movies. And he would say, yes, Dr. Chris, I'd love to go to the movies with you. And, and we'd go. And, and maybe sometimes he would even ask me, you know, to go someplace with him. He could, he could call me and say, hey, Chris, you know, I got off-Broadway tickets to this play. You want to come? And I would say, oh, how did you know that I like off-Broadway plays? And he would say, because, you know, we're, we're Dr. Chris. That's the way we roll. And then we'd go and see the play. And he'd bring me backstage, and, and we'd get to meet all of the actors. And I'd say, oh my god, you, how did you get backstage to meet these actors? How, how is that possible? And he would say, oh, I was, you know, parasailing over in Hawaii, and I met them, and now I'm an actor because I met them. And I said, oh my god, you're an actor? And he would say, yes, I am an actor. And I would say, I've always wanted to act. And he would say, you just have to follow your dreams, Chris. Like, he would say, don't give up and don't lose confidence. But you know, the thing is that like, we, we wouldn't be able to, to do that. Like, our future selves haven't invented travel between parallel universes. So they would have to invent that and travel into our universe. So we have to wait for them. Like, we just have to wait. We can't do it. We just have to wait and hope, I guess. I, uh, <clears throat> I put together this uh, diagram here um, to kind of, you know, help explain my theory. So the, the dotted line represents the uh, parallel universe. It's basically that is what's separating us. 